What's he doing? He's just chilling. Oh no, you see that fake cheese? Oh yeah. Oh my God, good uh, thing that's not in there. Yeah, I'm glad. He probably would eat this fake rubber snake. We definitely don't want that to happen. He's looking for a snake. Oh, I hope not. Or a rabbit. Uh, I don't mind a rabbit. Get a rabbit, Slinky. But no snakey poos, okay? However, truth be told, whoa. <laughs> Got out of the way, just in the nick of time. Just in the nick of time, I'm still pretty quick. What's going on everyone? It's been a while, but I think it's time to bring Slinky out. I haven't had him out in a long time since we built this really awesome enclosure, but we're getting his attention with some food right now. I wanna bring him out for a walkabout, maybe even bring him over to the recreation pond because it's been so long and I don't know how much longer we'll be able to do this with Slinky, with all the new rules and regulations that might be coming down the pipe. So while we're okay at the moment, I just wanna kind of bring him out, just enjoy himself a little bit. Come on, Slinky! It's always fun to get your lizard out and uh, you know, play with them. Yeah, play with your lizard, friends. I mean, it's important. But you can see how fast he is, man. Go on, Slinky. And I want him to work for his food, you know? This is some real fun enrichment. Let's see if we can get him up and over this fence and let's see how good his eyes are. I'm walking pretty far away, guys. Let's see if we can get his attention right here. Let's see how good these eyes are. I don't think he sees. Maybe, hold on. Nope, I don't think it's working. <laughs> He's going home, guys. Slinky. We don't want you to go home, Slinky. We got more fun for you. This is how much he likes his home. Yeah, and that's a good sign, actually. It is also a good sign. Up, oh, Slinky. Oh, oh, come on. Come on. Look at that thing go. Come on. Oh, good boy. Let's get him up and over here. Come on. You got to come up. You got to come up. You got to come up. Got to come up. Oh, come on. Come on. Look come how on. strong he is. Oh, he's so strong. Yes, I just want to get him to the recreation pond area. He hasn't been over here in a long time. It'll be interesting to see. Oh, you heard his jaws actually snap on that one. Woo! Good boy. Look how big he is. He is huge, isn't he? Oh, and he feels so warm. He's been laying in the sun. He is the coolest lizard, huh? Would you guys ever want a pet like this? I think I know the answer if you're watching this channel. Yes, he is my favorite guy. I love him so much. And that's why I just want to hang out with him a little bit. He's never tried to run away from me. He's a big fella. He wants to stay where he's getting fed. But now is the fun spot. I just love watching Slinky walk and enjoy the recreation pond. He's just gonna walk around. But guys, I've got to be careful because as you know, a few years ago, he found and ate a snake. I don't want that to happen. Oh, it was crazy, Matt. We I've actually have footage it. of it. I've watched it. So cool. Here he is. Come on. Come on. Let's take him over here towards this. Let's take him over towards the water and see if he's interested in taking a dip. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here it is. You got to come on. Up. You got to go swimming. You got to go swimming. You got to go swimming. Oh, there you go. Woo, the water's fine. You know what, guys? Back in 2012, I went to California with a buddy of mine and uh, we visited a woman who had an amazing water monitor like Slinky. And she let me swim in her pool with the lizard. And I knew from that day on, I needed to have a beautiful water monitor of my own so that I could swim with Slinky as well. And that's what I'm hoping I'm able to do today. It's been a while since we've been in the pond with him. I love watching him do his thing. And my God, is he just the most beautiful creature of all time? I mean, he's definitely the king of the camp, don't you guys think? Do you think Slinky's the king of the camp? In your opinion, who is the king of Camp Kennedy? Of course, besides me. But if I'm being honest, the animals are of a higher stature than I am, my God. Let's see, he's gonna go looking around. I hope there's no snakes around today. Definitely don't want another snake murder here. Slinky, do you wanna go swimming with your daddy? What do you guys think? Should I pick him up and go swimming? I think so. This is how you know he's your baby boy. You could just pick the Slinkies up and we're gonna walk over here. Come on, you big fella. He's my big salami, as the ladies would say. Oh, whoa. Oh, 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 God. Oh my God, Slinks. He thinks he's falling. He's not oh. falling. Oh God, come on, go down. Let's go swimming with daddy, come on. I'll give you more treats. It's been a while, friends, but I think we gotta do it. He is the coolest lizard on earth. Just an amazing animal. I'm gonna keep these chicks with me and see if I can get him into the pond. Slinky, Slinky. What's daddy got? Slinky, look what I got, look what I got, look what I got, look what I got. Slinky, hey, Slinky. Oh, oh, here it is. He sees it now. He sees it now, come on. Come on, come on. Whoa, ooh, ooh, I'm falling. Get in here, get in here. Come on, it's just water, you silly goose, come on. I'm standing on these rocks. My God, I'm gonna go swimming. 
Just like Slinky here. You're about to slip in. Oh, I'm in. Come on. Oh, you're not in the mood? You're not in the mood to swim? Oh, he's got saliva dripping. Come on, come on. Don't be shy. I'll give you the food. There we go. That's a good boy. That's a good boy, Slinky Poo. I got another one. I got another one. It's out here. There he is. Come here. Ooh, get over here. <laughs> Slinky, you made daddy get in the water. It's freezing. Maybe that's why he doesn't want to go in. Oh, it's definitely actually, it's not, it's not that bad. Oh, I love Slinks. What's he doing? He's just chilling. Oh no, you see that fake? Oh yeah, oh my God, good uh, thing that's not in there. Yeah, I'm glad. He probably would eat this fake rubber snake. We definitely don't want that to happen. I don't even let him see that. I know. It's just so much fun to have Slinky hanging out here again. Part of the reason I love uh, doing this with him is because he's an amazing animal. He's so socialized to me. It's an honor that I have an animal like this that tolerates me, that loves me this well. I don't know if he loves me. Maybe I'm just kind of putting that on him. I don't mean to put any pressure on you, Slinks, but I really want to take this relationship to the next level. And I do love you dearly, boy. I don't mind if it's just me that loves him. I know he respects me because he's happy, he's healthy, and he does all the things he's supposed to be doing. Now, there are rabbits that live in here. I wouldn't mind if he got a rabbit, if I'm being honest, because some rabbits have been eating some of my plants. But let's see what he does. This is the perfect opportunity for me to tell you, friends, that he is being a true monitor lizard. He's walking around, he's using his tongue, he's finding any chemical cues. This is how these animals go about the business of finding food and just interacting with their habitats. And you can see right now, he's probably on the scent of one of those rabbits. See that tongue comes out? His head goes side to side. The forked tongue's picking up chemical cues from the ground and the air. And he's able to just be the best detective in the animal kingdom, really. <laughs> you know, you got bloodhounds uh, that can smell really well. And then you have the snakes and lizards that have incredible dick vent here with their tongue and the Jacobson's organ, which is an organ in the roof of his mouth that those forks are going into. Every single time he pulls that tongue in, the two tips of the forks go to two holes. Oh, thank you. They go to two holes in the roof of his mouth and it sends a signal to his brain. Uh, what's going on? Is there food up ahead? Let's see what he does. He's so awesome, guys. I love the way he moves. Do you love the way he moves? Oh, <laughs> he does not like when I get behind him. But this is how he moves. You gotta move like a slink. You gotta be a slinky. Oh, I'm gonna get it in my face, aren't I? We don't wanna get whipped. No way. He's looking for a snake. Oh, I hope not. Or a rabbit. Uh, I don't mind a rabbit. Get a rabbit, slinky. But no snaky poos, okay? However, truth be told, whoa. <laughs> Got out of the way, just in the nick of time. Just in the nick of time, I'm still pretty quick. But anyhow, he loves to eat snakes, to be honest. He's eaten that water snake and he also ate a pretty expensive diamond python from my friend Jay at Prehistoric Pets. He pulled it right through his cage. Pretty crazy. Let's see where he's going. But do you see, do you see how he puts his head into all these positions, into all these little crevices? Because he knows there could be a tasty treat right there. But the smart thing he's doing is he's walking around the water's edge. He's not going in the water. He's just kind of hanging out in the water's edge. Look at the, uh, look at this quick, get up and look at the black throat. Oh, the black throat just hightailed it into his cave because he saw Slinky down below. That's crazy. How awesome is this guys? Slinky is the raddest lizard ever. And having him walk around, man, so cool. Hey, where are you going, Slinks? I don't want you to get in there. Hey, psst. Oh, I don't think he can get in there, do you? No, there's a big hole in the bottom now. That yeah, that hole is actually, in. it's where a wellhead is. Yeah. He seems quite interested in that. Well, there might be something living down in there. I don't know. You have any more chicks? No more chicks, so it's gonna be manhandling Slinky to get him out. But I'll be honest with you, the last time Slinky got a snake, it wasn't too far away from here. So I'm gonna keep real close eye on him to make sure he's not gonna nibble on anything he shouldn't be. Wow, Slinky. They got those powerful limbs also. They can dig, oh, a little sneeze too. They can dig, they can move earth, they can rip open burrows and logs and anything they might need to because they've got those sharp, strong claws and powerful limbs. These guys are aquatic and terrestrial. They're a true amphibious reptile. And they make use of all those habitats in their search for food. And I love that he's just exploring, right? It's daddy, that's right, where are you gonna go? 
Where are you gonna go? It's daddy's feet. There you go, buddy. So cool, man. I can only, I, I love to do this because I like to imagine that I'm in Southeast Asia, someplace where these guys are native and you're actually seeing them in the wild. Of course, they would not let you touch them. They would not let you put hands on them, of course, but it's still amazing that we have such cool habitats here at the camp that these animals can get out. I can do enrichment with them, one-on-one -on -one enrichment. Um, I would not allow any of the other monitors out. Slinky and I, I do trust this lizard. I know this lizard will not bolt from me. It's been a relationship that's developed naturally over time. Now watch, he's gonna walk away from me. I'm gonna try not to move because this is usually the position you're in when you get a wallop from Slinky's tail. But I'm gonna relax and just let him go by. And when he's comfortable enough, I'll stand up. The other thing I gotta be careful of now, friends, is the last time he was here, there were no alligators. This guy could definitely slip through the cage, I think. I don't know, he might be a little too big to actually go through the gate area, but I would hate to have Slinky become a treat for an alligator, would not be good. To be honest, this is where the murder happened. This is where Slinky found the snake. I haven't seen any snakes back here in a while. See, I'm just touching them to let them know I'm here. Hey, yo! He gets a little startled, but then he just keeps going. I wonder if he's gonna go in that water. So cool. Are you guys having fun watching Slinky right now? Would you guys do this with, would you guys wanna do this with your lizards? Let me know in the comments below because I'm just like a little kid, man. Oh, look, he's gonna get a drink maybe. How cool is he? Oh my God, guys, look at this. What's he gonna do? And this is the fun part. You really get to watch an animal in its element do what it was designed to do. This is amazing. Isn't it cool, Matt? I mean, just the fact that we have him in these plants it really just gives me chills watching this guy do his thing. But he goes right into this mode. He goes right into this stalking hunting mode where he's really onto something. So it's the best enrichment for this animal's mind. Let's go around the other side. Just be careful on that waterfall. It can be slippy. Oh yes, let's get down in here and see what's happening. Slinky, where are you? Oh, there he is. You see him? Yeah, I'm kidding. He's camo. That is so awesome. It does not get better than this, friends. This is so cool. I've said it a million times. I'm so thankful to the guys at Aquascape for building this habitat. Hey, Slinks. No, it's okay. I think I'm scaring him more than you are. He is so big in here, man. It's the coolest thing. Large and in charge. All right, guys. Well, I'll tell you what, this is amazing, but I don't wanna really push my luck. I don't want Slinky to get into any trouble because having him nail a native animal would be a bummer. And I've learned my lesson the last time. He's also getting a little close to the gators. So what I'd like to do is I'm gonna pick Slinky up. I'm gonna pick this dude up. Okay, of course I gotta walk behind him. Hey buddy, hey buddy. He gets annoyed. <laughs> oh, back you come. Oh, now let's bring him back to his house. Oh, I don't wanna push, I don't wanna push it. But the cool thing is, is that we gave Slinky an opportunity oh, to be a monitor lizard today. And I love that. Oh, he's swarming. He's a squirmer, but he's a learner. Oh, oh God, oh, he's gonna pierce my nipple. He's gonna pierce my nipple. And so part of the reason why we have such a large enclosure for Slinky, he's a large lizard. And these large lizards need a lot of space. Monitors are active, they're intelligent, and oh, they're heavy, it turns out. But here we go. And I'll be honest. This is a cool habitat for Slinky to live in. He gets to do all the same things in here, but it was cool to bring him out and to show him around and to, oh, bah, 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 bah. don't you dare, don't you do it, buddy. He's good, I can't believe he didn't whip you. No, he's a good guy. He doesn't like being held too much. He squirms around a bit, but, but the minute you put him down, he's back to normal. He's back to normal. He's a good boy. People ask, how did I tame him? I didn't. He basically tamed himself. So we'll just leave Slinky. What'd you guys think today? Was that fun to hang out with Slinky and walk around with him? Didn't quite go swimming with him, but you know what? There's always next time. I just want to say thanks to everybody watching the videos and hanging out with Slinky and I as he saunters on off. I'm out of here. I'll talk to you guys again real soon. See ya.